in the name of Allah, the most gracious, the most merciful. Here I back again with the new lesson, which will be for the unit six, um, first semester. Um, actually, we are going to talk about the title of the unit. What was it like? What was it like? So, uh, today we are going to have the symbol past tense. Symbol past tense. So, unit six, listen to symbol past tense. So, it talked about actions that happened and ended in the past. Okay? So, it is consists out of pronoun plus the verb plus time expression. So, the verb here consists out of two items. Number one, regular verb or irregular verb. Okay, irregular verb. So look at the two examples. So let me show the, the whole documents. Just wait. Let me show the whole document. Um, that's it. Okay. So here, the verb is regular and irregular. Time expression, we're going to have uh, two items which last. Then we're going to mention the things. Uh, the day or uh, the month or the year or anything else, okay? So, um, we're going to have that that word. So, look at this. Last. I'm going to complete with a word. Last Monday, last Sunday, last day, last year, last month, and yesterday. Okay, look at the two examples. He walked He walked to school yesterday. He walked to school yesterday. Number one, number two, number three. Now, irregular verb, irregular verb, he went to school last Sunday. He went to school last Sunday. So, verb be in the past, verb be in the past. Verb be, it will be also two kind, was and where, was and where. I, he, she, it was, they, we, you, were. Look at the example. I was at home yesterday. I was at home yesterday. They were at home last Sunday, last Sunday. How was the meeting? How was the meeting? Affirmative. It was great. It was great. It wasn't great. It wasn't great. It wasn't great if it is negative. Okay, listen to this one here if it is a uh, fair be as a question. Short answers. Was the meeting great? Was the meeting great? Yes, it was great. Yes, it was. Yes, it was. Okay. No. It wasn't. No, it wasn't. So this is here negative, and this one here is affirmative. B. Uh, we talked about this one here as verb be in the past. Okay, verb be in the past. Was and where. Here, helping verb did. Helping verb did. Okay, regular form. Okay, look at the example. Okay, to the second one. I stayed at home. I stayed at home. I stayed at home. So, uh, this sentence is regular verb, is regular form, regular form of verb in simple past tense. Okay, so when I want to make a question, so I'm going to ask about this part, which is the underline. What did you do yesterday? What did you do yesterday? I stayed home. I visited my friend or anything else. So if I want to make it negative, it will be look like this one here. I did it's coming from the ed did ed okay i did not because this is here negative i didn't stay home i didn't stay home and this is here the simplified and the easiest way just to understand that the regular form is will uh, work like this okay it's work like this so irregular form irregular form uh here he went he went to school last monday he went to school last monday so, uh, I'm going to ask about to school, okay? Where did he go? Where did he go last Monday? He went to school last Monday. I want to make this negative. I didn't go. I didn't go to school last Monday. So, be attention for this one here. This tab. Okay, this grammar. Verb after did should be infinitive. Verb after did should be infinitive. Otherwise, if it is in the question, huh, did go or in the sentence if it is negative i didn't go i didn't go also here did do did do now here stayed 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 or here uh, didn't stay didn't stay didn't stay so verb after did in question 
or in negative sentence should be infinitive should be infinitive so you got to pay attention for that one so gentlemen so this is here the end of our lesson for today i hope you enjoy it i'm going to see you in another one soon inshallah subhanahu wa ta'ala thank you so much bye bye